Hello, my little YouTube tribe of 15 subscribers. Uh, just a quick video, let you know something I found today. Uh, had a project I was working on for some chickens we got. And anyway, I need some things from Lowe's. And for those that are preppers or homesteaders um, that store foods or other things in five gallon buckets, I found these. Now it's nothing new, but they normally go by the name of Gamma Lid. Uh, these are from Lowe's. They're by a company called Lean Tight. It's the same thing as a Gamma Lid, except instead of having two bars like this, it's just got the one. Uh, they are $9 instead of almost 14 at Tractor Supply. And so I just wanted to share that with you, kind of show you how they work. I got one on the bucket here, and this is in case any of you all don't know what they are. They make it so, i uh, try to do this. <laughs> it's hard to do with one hand and trying to hold the camera. Anyway, they screw out like that. It's just a coarse thread. They do have a gasket. As you see, it runs around here. Now I've seen the videos where the gamma lids are supposed to be airtight or watertight and people have filled them up, sealed them up, sealed them upside down, water still leaks out of them. I'm not too concerned about that. I just like them mostly for the fact that when you put the five gallon lids on that, are, that come with the buckets, when they snap in here, they can be a real pain in the ass to pry off and uh, whatnot. And I love using these gamma lids, or in this uh, case, these uh, leak tight screw top lid, um, because all I have to do is unscrew it like I showed you, and boom, I got access to whatever's inside. No fuss, no muss. Anyway. Uh, and like I say, uh, at Tractor Supply, the actual gamma lids right now are running close to $14. Um, not too long ago, before the mess in the country, um, they were about 8 or $9. Anyway, I found these at Lowe's, different brand name, same idea, and they were $8.98 a piece. So just some information for you guys in case you're using these and want a, a more cost-effective uh alternative but that's how they work that's what they are and that's what they cost and try to do this without scaring them too much but we got this for the homestead not too long ago a couple more weeks or so they'll be ready to go into the hen house but we got nine chicks from the neighbor these things are going for like 20 bucks. Pullets. These are probably, I guess, considered a little bit less than pullets, but we got barred rocks and then uh, I think the other ones are cocoa morans or some kind of moran, but they lay really dark brown eggs. And uh, so, anyway, that's just some new goings on here at the homestead, and I thought I'd share with y'all. So, this big pile of lumber to work on a wall in here in this uh, storage building. So anyway, just wanted to share that with my uh, YouTube tribe here. Hope you're all doing well. Appreciate everything. Appreciate any comments, uh, likes, uh, any more subscriptions or anything. Very much appreciated. And uh, hope you all have a great weekend or what's left of it. This is Muddy Bear. I'm out.